in May of 1983 during the first week of May of that year, while camping in the Santa Fe National Forest in northern New Mexico, I experienced a most peculiar visitation. I was 30 years old at the time, and a trade school student, machine drafting, in Albuquerque. I was part of a student group from the Southwest Indian Polytechnic Institute in Albuquerque. We were camping fairly high, up in the mountains hills, on an alcohol-free student activity, prior to the end of the school year. Our student advisor was a Mr. Ray Patmo from the Pueblo of Acoma, New Mexico. Early that morning, at around 4 a.m., I was asleep in my own tent alone, when I was actually awakened by an awful stench. This foul odor was so powerful, the scent actually burnt my nostrils. I sat up in my sleeping bag just in time, to see a massive light brown hairy arm reach into the tent through the front flap, and start to feel around. Totally horrified, I started to hyperventilate, as this huge arm clearly was not human. Just as I was about to scream my lungs out, the arm drew back and out of the tent. I was strangely aware then, that there were two creatures right outside of my tent, as I heard two separate and distinct vocalizations one male and one female. Through the dim, outside light, and through the tent material, I could make out at least two figures possibly eight feet in height. The next thing I heard were these two beings yelling loudly, as they apparently ran away from my tent. I stayed awake until sunrise and was so enthralled by what had happened that I could not bring myself to tell anyone about this event, and at breakfast, no one else there was talking about any similar occurrence. I have never told anyone about this until earlier this year.